Hello, you lovely lot. How are we today? Um, I hope you've been able to enjoy some sunshine. If there is some where you are. Um, it's been a bit of a manic weekend, really. Lots of repairs and um, and things to do. So um, I'm only just getting round to doing my video now. Well done on all the videos I've got in. I've been uh, just watching them as I've been writing down titles. I think there's about 10, 11 in. Which is fantastic and uh, and the first timer drew well done well done drew nerve-wracking pressing that red record button isn't it um but it's great so next week will be themed now when i say what the theme for next week is you might think oh that's really boring i want you to use your imaginations the theme for next week is a nursery rhyme of some description. Now you can play something as simple as go and tell Aunt Nancy. Da 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 da. Or you can play something a little more complicated. A couple of you have a duet, for example, called the Grand Old Duke of York, but it's not as you know it. Um, so I want you to be a bit inventive. See if you can find something on the good old internet um, or ask me for something and I can send you um, something very simple and then see what you can do to, to jazz it up a little bit, change the rhythms, live dangerously or find um, a slightly more complicated version. But um, do ask if you are searching for something. Um, it's something that you will all be doing regardless of whether you submit a video. So I sincerely hope the um, those of you that posted this week will continue to do so. Um, it's really good to see. It's really good. To, it's really encouraging to see. So I'm going to play today a piece by, as some, some flute people will know, one of my favourite modern composers, John Raybould. It's called Carnival Calypso. I think a couple of you may have looked at this um, from that new book that I've been using. Um, so I hope you enjoy. I'm also using this flute today as mine is packed ready for band. This is Louis. He's called, he's, uh, his make is a Louis and Co. And uh, obviously he's wooden, doesn't have a lip plate, so just a hole where you blow. And um, a one piece body, so there's no separate foot joint here. It's all one piece. Um, so I thought I'd use uh, Louis today. It's been a little while since he's had an airing. So here we go. sound of this one isn't it uh, and he's got a bit of a squeaky kick 
Here you go, squeaky key. <laughs> He's not been played for a while, so he needs a little bit of an oil, but um, there we go. So um, have some thoughts about what nursery rhyme. Um, I do have some in various books and bits and bobs and things. So think how you can be a little bit more inventive and creative. There you go. But everyone can play a nursery rhyme. That's why I chose nursery rhymes. Um, so have some fun and well done again. Well done again. And I will see you all this coming week.